Glasgow Cup player still down, but Celtic with a one-man advantage and Mr Dembele on the ball, Tierney ahead of him, Forrest through the middle. Goes for the 1-2 with Forrest, it breaks out to the left-hand side, the Alice Cup player still down, Tierney, out way to Forrest on this left touch line, cuts onto his right foot, plays it to Dembele, spins round his man, good skill from Dembele, still got the ball, he's in the box, takes a shot, and Mr Dembele, well, determination, skill, Celtic 1, Alice Kerr now. Well, Musa Dembele gets his prize for persistence there, Paul. Magnificent play from the striker. He was the one filled initially. The Alice Kerr player still on the ground. Musa Dembele got up, continues with the attack, and when he got to the edge of the box, there was three, four, five Alice Kerr players around him. They couldn't muscle him off the ball. He was more determined. He showed great desire, and then eventually got the shot away. It finds the far corner. Celtic lead. Well, Kancerovic had absolutely no chance there, but Musa Dembele was determined not to give that one up. And as uh, Mark says, he was the man who was fouled, but the referee played the advantage. Musa Dembele joined the attack, and he has put Celtic in absolute control. Well, I'll, I'll wait and see the replay here. It's wonderful play from Watson Edward. He skips in, and it's number... I'm not sure if it's number 70, is Eddie Garian? No, it's number 21, actually, it's Gregorian. Well, the Alice Kirk player, I think he definitely thought he'd got the ball, but uh, the Romanian referee, Dembele, so cool. Remember that first goal he scored for Celtic, the penalty against Astana. Seems so long ago now. The young Frenchman on the verge of putting Celtic 2-0 up on the night and 5-0 ahead on aggregate with just about 19 minutes on the clock. The whistle goes, Mr Dembele composes himself, steps forward. And it's in the back of the net, and Celtic leading by two goals to nil. And it's Mr. Dembele with his second goal of the night. Yeah, Kilmer's personified, as you'd expect from Mr. Dembele in those situations, Paul. He's always so composed, and he steps up to the penalty spot. That was a, a wonderful finish. The goalkeeper tried to deceive him, dived one way, dived the other, but Mr. Dembele was focused, knew when he was putting it, and he made no mistakes. Well, Mr. Dembele, he could be going home with the match ball tonight. He's already got two goals and we haven't even played 20 minutes yet. I know we always bemoan the standard of refereeing in Scotland, but my goodness, I wouldn't like to see a Romanian game if this is the standard of the referees. Yeah, he's certainly been the, the focus of attention so far, a controversial red card. Come the attack with numbers, it's four against four. Watson Edward, he's got options, chance for James Forrest. Wonderful finish, James Forrest! He raced from one end to the other and delivered a wonderful finish, Celtic. Three, Alice Kirk now. Well, that was an absolutely tremendous counter attack from Celtic ball. Wonderful stuff. As they all started with Alice Kirk corner, Celtic won possession, broke it, lightning speed. Watson Edward driving through the middle. I thought he was delayed the pass slightly, but he picked the right moment to release James Forrest. And as we said, James Forrest playing with such confidence and such belief. And that was an emphatic, accurate finish into the far corner to put Celtic 3 0 up. Well, Watson Edward did so well there. He had options to the right, options to the left, and he just waited for the exact moment to lay the ball into the path of James Forrest. And it was a precise, almost Callum McGregor esque in its finish there, but uh, beyond. Kancerovic, he's had no chance with any of the goals and a wonderful finish again from James Forrest. Two competitive goals already and uh, marking his, his 70th.